Hi, it's Sherry and welcome to the Eyes Have It. Today I'm going to be doing my June Nature Box unboxing. So, as I've shown before, this is the Nature Box. I get the Deluxe Box, which is five packages of snacks. And I'm going to do a little taste test for you. Okay, the very first one is one that I've had before and that I love. And it's called Big Island Pineapple. It's just dried pineapple rings. And literally the ingredients are dried pineapple. Period. And as I've said before, that's one of the things I love about Nature Box. And also, this is, I think, the first time all five of my snacks are nutritionist approved snacks, which is pretty cool. So this is the dried pineapple. Some months it's a little drier, some months it's a little moister. This month it's a little moister. Really, really nice. I love the taste of it. I love the chewiness of it. It's just delicious and it's sweet without, you know, with just being nat the natural sweetness and the drying process, of course. And next we have my very favorite, the Roasted Kettle Kernels. Had these before and I ask for them in every box. So, here are the corn kernels. They are um, very good, very crunchy. And they are a combination of sweet and salty. Now we're going to get into some things that I have not had before. First is the Pear Praline Crunch. Pear flavored praline pecans in cashews. So, if you know what praline is, it's like a sort of a toffee, sugary sort of coating. And uh, they've in, in, they've put in some pear essence so that in addition to sweet and toffee, it has a pear taste. The pear taste is clearly evident. They are very, very sugary as anything toffee would be. Let me check the nutrition facts on these. Okay, for a quarter cup, it is 160 calories, 10 grams of fat, 1 gram sat fat, uh, 0 cholesterol, 70 milligrams sodium, 16 total carbs, 1 gram of fiber, 12 grams of sugar, 2 grams of protein. You know, they're no higher in sugar than a lot of the other stuff that I get, but um, it, it, it's really, really sweet. I mean, I you definitely wouldn't want to eat much of it. And the ingredients, pecans, sugar, cashews, brown sugar, corn syrup, honey, natural flavor, and salt. Um, so, yeah, a lot of sugaring uh, ingredients there. So, I mean, I think it's nice for a change, but is it something that I would want to sit and munch on all the time? Not so sure yet. Alright, the other one that I've never had before, and I thought it sounded pretty promising, and that is the Salted Caramel Pretzel Pops. Sea salt and caramel coated pretzels. Now, you may recall that last month I got the bruschetta, bruschetta and rosemary, I think, pretzel pops. And for me, those were a total fail. Um, I really liked the bruschetta flavor. That was not a problem. But uh, they used some sort of tomato powder or something to represent the, the bruschetta part. And it was too sweet for me. Um, I, I kind of expected them to be savory and they were the, on the inside, but the outside when I would first crunch into them I got this sugary hit that was just kind of not what I was looking for. So these are salted caramel pretzel pops. 
and they also have sea salt on them so here again you've got that sweet and salty type of thing so here they are they're very crunchy my experience and excuse me for eating I've only had these once before right now in my experience was as you're starting to eat them you only get sweet and then as you finish eating and swallow you get the sea salt it kind of hits you in the back um, these also are very sweet they are tasty not in the way that for example the dark cocoa almonds are they have they are very here again like the praline the prayer pear praline crunch they are very very sweet and I'm trying to find things that are not as sweet that still satisfy me but don't cause that sugar addict thing to kick in and I also have to say that these taste just slightly stale it could just be the way they are The nutrition information on the salted caramel pretzel pops for one third cup serving, it's 110 calories, half a gram of sat fat, so that's very good. Um, I'm sorry, half a gram of total fat, no sat fat, no cholesterol, 260 milligrams of sodium, 26 total carbohydrates, zero dietary fiber, 12 grams of sugar and two grams of protein so these have the same amount of sugar that the pear praline crunch do and they they also have that for me over sugary taste so my last item I had one other time and in fact I didn't even have any to show you for the unboxing because I had eaten it in one sitting and uh, I, I said, okay, don't get that again because obviously this is not something that you can watch yourself with. Um, but I got it again. At least one more month. And that is the coffee kettle popcorn. It says kettle corn with coffee caramelized popcorn. So if you're a caramel fan and a coffee fan and a popcorn fan, I think there's very little chance you're not going to love this. I I love caramel. I love popcorn. I don't, I'm not a daily coffee drinker, but I really do love the taste of coffee. And when I drink coffee, it is black. So I like that. It is plain, unadulterated taste of coffee. So these are a combination of the caramelized pieces and the regular pieces so they're all sort of caramelized but some have I guess the coffee and some don't so therefore it doesn't become overwhelming I think that was a really really smart thing for them to do also nice and crunchy just the right balance of sweet and salty and bitter the coffee part is a little bitter, but not bad. Okay, that's my Nature Box for June. I've really been enjoying it thus far, and it's actually even helped me lose weight because I have really healthy ingredients, really healthy snacks, and um, I can get things that are satisfying without being too sugary, too fatty, whatever the or, and too salty because that's an issue too. Alrighty, that's all for right now. See you next time. Bye.